Hello, welcome. Thanks for joining me, the Suffolk Shaver, for another shave video. Today uh, it's a request video. Uh, a little while back, one of my subscribers, um, Thriller the Shave, asked for uh, this particular soap to be used because he saw it in my uh, channel art. It's the uh, Bohemian by Shave and Shop, which is made by uh, K Shave Works. It's a sort of a real hippie kind of scent, sort of patchouli, rose, all those kind of scents. And I've got the uh, match and splash to go with it. The brush I'm using today is another one of my Macetto's, but it's in the uh, black classic candle, two band. You can see it's all ready, loaded and ready to go, save a bit of time. Razor again, obviously I'm using the uh, Sanguine Shave It all this month. Uh, the Allen block just in case and uh, that's about it I think I'll put on the uh, pre-shave so it's, uh, it's sitting on my face softening the beard I've just recently had a shower so let's hydrate that again I've taken my sides up a little bit I have to bite the bullet and uh, Go to the barbers next Monday to get a haircut. So, here we go. Hope you've had a good week. Nice things planned for the weekend. I've got to finish work. Um, not by the time you see this, I would have already be ready and down there. We're going to the uh, Litridge Town FC football ground on their uh, practice area. They open it up to the uh, public, they're having a big TV and we can watch the um, England-Sweden game there. So, all the best to Sweden. May the best team win. Making sure there's enough water in the lava before I start. It's a little bit thicker than the, the last one. Love these Masato knots, they're two bands, so you get a nice, nice backbone. Hair's a little thicker than the uh, silver tip, so you don't lose any hairs. Loads of lava there, like it's running down the handle. Pop that there. So I just checked on uh, Jim Co Shaven Experience's channel this morning and he's got 111 subscribers. I did uh, message him on uh, Facebook Messenger but uh, he's not responded yet. So we start with uh, one finger at the start.
easier for me to see in the uh, mirror than it is to look on a, like a two inch screen. So uh, whatever happens tomorrow, hopefully we'll uh, have a good time. It's, uh, it's all free, so we just have to be there before half past one when the gates open. quite a few people so uh, there's no fear of not sort of getting in. My skin does feel a little bit different uh, with a shave at shave and with a, uh, a DE shave that's feel a little bit sort of tender for about an hour and a half but then after that it's gone. Use his uh, actual Kamasuri. Don't see uh, too many of those on the shaving channels. And then Chris, another car both the other go at uh, Spencer's. Come on, sorry. It's one that takes these uh, artisan, artist blades, feather artist blades. He used a um, Kai blade. They're not as wide, so the, the, the blade is not there's not so much exposure. Just a note to um Peter, who won the, uh, or one person that won the um, 
brush giveaway. You've not emailed me yet, so if you get to watch this, can you email me by by the weekend? Um, Sunday night at the latest UK time. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do this again and uh, give that brush to someone else. Anybody knows uh, Peter as a friend, if you could contact him so he can contact me at the Suffolk Shaver at gmail.com. As soon as sooner he gets in contact, the sooner I can get the brush away. Most comfortable pass so far. And I saw uh, Kevin Shaves use the uh, timeless razor this morning. Very nice looking razor. Fine with the chin, you have to. I think I said it in the last video. You have to, it's a steeper angle. Nice first pass. I'll just uh, pause it here, uh, get some fresh water, and uh, back in a second. Okay, back for the second pass. And they're just doing sort of two passes. I think there's enough for me. It's not BVS, but um, it's a close shave. Getting a sort of a tingle from it. Spot there. 
can't remember the last time I used this uh, if I had a reactor from or not. Last game, England, Colombia. I was at work. So I had to uh, catch what I could on the radio because we were so close to um, well, being on the dock and uh, interference. I didn't really hear much of it. I managed to get back to the yard for uh, second part of the extra time and the penalties. So. Going to go to the uh, our social club, sports and social club to watch it. But uh, my son had this had the idea of coming down to the town ground and watching it there. Be a little bit more of an experience for it. So I'm making this video so uh, flashboard and don't have to watch it. So I've got Jim Co not making videos. Flash is making videos but he's not watching videos. I try and watch as many videos as I can. 
just especially like keeping up with uh, like certain few that I watch on a regular basis, you know, to try and keep keep on top of. Well, then doing that, then other channels, you know, I don't get to see as much. But, uh, no, I do do what I can. You know, you got other things outside of wet shaving to do, and you? you got work, got to sleep. I think not to really get a, a good detailed shave I'd have to you know get right into the uh, mirror to get a sort of a close but obviously I can't do that when you're you're watching so I'll uh, pause here again uh, wash my face off there's no weepers or anything there was one there, but that's uh, sort of ahead of a spot or something. I'll be back in a second. Okay, we just rinse the face off, just put some alum on the face. Bit of this thing not too bad. I think part of that is due to the uh, reaction from the lather. So. Just leave that on for a second. We'll go for the stars of shave and I'll rinse it off. This was the uh, Sanguine shave out with the uh, Pulse Silver. It's had uh, three shaves on now. Brush was the, which I just rinsed out, Masetto Classic and Black Two Band Badger. I think that's 26mm knot. Soap was the uh, Bohemian by the uh, Shaver Shop via uh, K Shave Works. So I hope you enjoyed that through the shave. I think that was uh, worth what I'm for. I've got uh, two weeks off next month going away for one week I'll uh, take the camera see if I can get a uh, shave in and take some footage of uh, where we are okay there be a hemim aftershave let me show you the ingredients there. It's got a witch hazel on it, rose water, aloe vera, polysorbate. It's got alum in it, so that'll be double alum and uh, fragrance oil. It was uh, this time you know, last year that we were uh, getting ready to go to Florida. I'm flying. It's got that sort of, um, if you go into sort of a, a museum or somewhere, that's got that sort of, um, that old smell, that, I don't know how to put it. Old sort of fusty kind of smell you get. Some animal on your lips. Yeah, I mean, they've got uh, displays of things, items that are like hundreds of years old and they give off that kind of um, 
I already smell. Yeah, nice close shave. To me for the weekend. So uh, th as I said, I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for uh, watching. Thanks for your likes. Thanks for your comments and your subscriptions if you've recently subscribed. And uh, have a great weekend. Have some great shaves and. Uh, See you very soon for another shave. Cheers. Bye. Come on, England.